October has always been a special month. Uh, I remember in 1987, I was very, uh, you know, I was very convinced that Mark was, in no, was not, not in trouble and I didn't worry about things. And Carol and I had planned this great uh, golf vacation to Ireland and we we're going to visit one course and save a little house and visit another, go all along the west coast of Ireland and play golf. And we left on a Thursday night and uh, the Mark went down 55 points that day, which was not too good. And uh, <laughs> the next day we got to Ireland because of the time difference, we'd completed our day and I got back to the hotel and I called in. The market had gone down 112 on Friday. I said to Carolyn, uh, you know, I think if the, if the market goes down on Monday, uh, you know, we're going to have to go back. And, uh, and so we, might as well, we stayed there for the weekend. And, uh, and on Monday, the market went down 508 points. And my fund went from, uh, I think, 12 billion to 8 billion. And uh, that gets your attention, you know, in a <laughs> two, two working days. You know, I said, at the end of this week, I'd be, uh, have no fund. Now, there wasn't a lot I could do. I mean, here I was. On Monday, because the market uh, didn't open, you know, by 12 o'clock it was in Ireland. It was still uh, 7 o'clock in New York. So we did spend that day, and we uh, we did we played around golf in the morning, and then we went somewhere and sort of watched the market uh, deteriorate. And uh, <laughs> and uh, I did come back. There wasn't nothing I could do. I mean, just uh, the, the, nothing I could do about it. it uh, but I think my shareholders, they called up and they said, "Well, what's Lynch doing?" They said, "Well, he's on the sixth hole, and he's, uh, you know." He's even par up to now, but he's in a trap. This could be, you know, this could be a triple bogey here. This could be a, could be a big inning. And uh, I, don't th I don't think that's exactly what they want to hear. That I can, they, so I could do something about this damn thing. So I came back home and uh, suffered with everybody else. And, and uh, fortunately, uh, I was very consistent. Uh, my, uh, the market went down. When I ran Magellan on 13 years, the market went down nine times. And every time the market went down, Magellan went down. It was nine for nine. And... Uh, you know, because it's, it's, very, it's very important. There's another one of these numbers you ought to write down. If you put $1,000 in a stock, all you can lose is 1000 I've done that several times. And, uh, but if you're right, you can make 5000 10000 20000 So this business, you don't have to be right one out of two times. You can be right one out of four. It's a long time. The times you're right, you know the company's doing well, you know they're doing a great job, and you add to it, or at least you don't sell it, which is a terrible tragedy. So. You can make more money on the upside, so I just, I just wrote those out, and I will now flip a coin to tell you where the market will go to 4,000, this year or next year. Uh, heads means it goes up, it's a two-headed coin. Uh, the market will go up in the next year. That's, it. That's all I ever know about the stock.